This is the elect intuitive prophetess back again with another spiritual energy read. Please subscribe to the channel. Press the like feature. Give me that thumbs up. It keeps me tapped in by permission to your current energy. All of my messages and readings are timeless. So whenever you hear it, that's when it's meant for you to apply it to your special situation. Please be advised that every read, every message is not for everyone. I may not be the preferred reader for you, but you're listening, so there's a message for you, and that's fine, because you're only going to take that which resonates and leave the rest behind. Good morning. A special shout out and welcome to the test, the Elexo tribe. I am so glad to have you guys in my energy on today. I do appreciate all the energetic exchanges that take place in the comment section. I do appreciate all of the financial contributions being made towards the growth and expansion of the channel. All cross watchers are welcome. Prophets, prophetess, seers, light workers, members of the soul tribe family. And we've recently welcomed all clergy who's ever a part of the clergy worldwide, you are welcome to uh, listen to my messages, my readings. Yes, you are welcome to this judge-free zone where we do not judge anyone, but we only offer light, love, hope, and healing as we assist one another on this journey that we call life. Let's tap straight into some spiritual energy before we move forward with our synopsis for today. Mm -hmm. The Lord has done it. This very day, let us rejoice today and be glad. I'm going to read it again. The Lord has done it this very day. Let us rejoice today and be glad. Psalms 118 verse 24. Let's just be glad. I know we're in situations. Could you guys know when I do these readings? Hey, sometimes I'm ministering as well to myself. But regardless of your circumstances, your situation, let's find some joy in it. I know it could be hard. Maybe you are just at rock bottom, but I got a word for you on today. Just remember, your worst day, your bad day is somebody's good day. And as the scriptures tells us, in all things, so let's learn how to be thankful that our situations aren't worse than what they are. Yes, your situation can always be worse. So on today, let's make it a great day. Let's stay positive. Let's think happy thoughts. Even when those uh, triggers arise, you may have to step aside for a moment, take a deep breath. I don't know what it is that you do to relieve stress or anger. I don't know. Go to the shooting range. I don't know. Whatever it is you have to do, get right back on fo focus, get right back on track. Look, bring that car right on back in your lane and keep moving forward. The reason why we're going to keep moving forward on today is because my collective, your energy is that of being um, at a spiritual standoff. You're gridlocked with somebody or situation. And I got, I started hearing spiritual standoff gridlock about nine o'clock last night. So y'all know me. I took some notes. Let me pull out the iPad here and let you guys, because I want you guys to get an understanding so that you can literally adjust the energies as needed. This may not be your read, but here we go. What does um, gridlock, I believe this is what it is. Was it gridlock first? Yes, gridlock. A traffic jam in which a grid of intersections, intersecting streets is so completely congested that no vehicular movement is possible. And then I, I, I got the slang definition. A situation or an argument or dispute when neither side is prepared to give in so no agreement can be reached. That's what a gridlock is. A standoff is a situation in which neither neither of the two opposing groups or forces will make a move until the other one does something so nothing can happen until one of them gives in. Let me tell you something. The person that's on your mind, they are definitely... Uh, why do I hear the word situational? I never even heard that word before. It probably isn't a word, but you guys know how spirit deals with me. Oh my God. They're in a situation or a today, <laughs> our word for today is a situational. Oh my goodness. Where they have a karmic energy. I'm hearing stuck like Chuck, stuck to them like hot tar on a summer day, melting on the pavement. 
Mm. Grits. Come on now. We don't want to hurt Al Green's feelings. One of my favorite singers. I love him. But what happens when you throw hot grits on a person? It doesn't just roll off like water. It sticks. Your person is in a situation. They're gridlocked. They're in a spiritual standoff with the karmic meaning they cannot go anywhere. I haven't even got started. Look. Look at what's on the top of the deck. I can't make this stuff up. I know y'all like, well, we didn't see you uh uh, deal with those cards out. You don't have to. They're sitting on top of the deck here. 15, 16, 16. Look at this tower. Devil. Tower energy. This is what your person is dealing with right now. To wake up first thing in the morning and get this kind of energy. Woo. They probably was fighting. Or or somebody done left the house, the 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 uh the property, wherever they're staying, wherever they're living. I'm sorry. This is about the person that's on your mind right now. This is a couple. This is, I'm, I'm, spirit is saying this could also apply to a group of people. They're at a spiritual standoff, a gridlock when it comes to you and your energy. They're frustrated. Your energy cannot come. They can't feel you. They can't get close to you. They need you. They can't come to you like they want to because of this spiritual gridlock, this standoff. This karmic is staring them down two for two, eye for eye. They're going at it toe to toe. Mm. Tip for tat. They are not giving in. They do not want to let your person go. And I'm telling you right now, your person acts for it. Be careful what you wish for. We got Will of Fortune and the reverse energy here. The Justice card. Karma. This is karma at its finest. This is karma at its peak. Something is about to blow. Things are coming to a head. Collective, don't you see nothing is being hidden from you? You are given a front row seat with a free Coke and a, and a box of popcorn to watch this craziness play out. They're gridlocked. He's almost said he's at a stand standoff with this queen of wands. I'm hearing that actually, in some cases, this karmic has the right to be the queen of wands. They took your person in. They're, they're nursing them. They're feeding them. They're paying all their bills. Now, remember, your person chose this because they were in narcissistic energy. Flip the energies as needed. This could be a feminine energy. It, it, just flip the energies. Energies is fluent. It's, it's current. It flows. It changes. Two of Pentacles in the reverse is here. I'm sorry. They, they're being forced to stay in this foolishness with this karma. They're being forced to with this karmic. They're being forced to do it. The universe, divine intervention is here. They're being kept away from you, period, for your protection. They are in a standoff, a gridlock with the karmic. Mm, they are so miserable. This is spiritual warfare at its finest. Your person needs your energy so that they can fight this demon, but they messed up. They burnt the bridge. They cut you off. They discarded you. They ghosted you. They chose somebody else over you. They did, didn't want to take accountability. When they had a chance to apologize, they refused to do it. They refused to see their wrong in the situation, and they manifested a spiritual gridlock and stand off with karmic activity. Let's get some names, some letters, some numbers. Whatever information Spirit wants to give us on today. What are the messages for the collective? Don't show us what we want to see, Spirit. Show us what we need to see. Give us the intuition. Open up our chakras from the crown of our heads to the sole of our feet. Increase our spiritual knowledge and understanding Upgrade our gifting so that we can see, so that we will not be fooled, so that we will not be taken advantage of. Yes, it sounds like I'm praying. That's fine. Pray with me. We need all the spiritual energy and protection from the 5D, from the angels. We need help from our angels. We need help from the Savior, from God, the Almighty, to protect us, to shield us. Mm, triggers, triggers, trigger warning, trigger warning. Trigger warning for the collective this weekend. Trigger warning. You're going to need to be strong. These people are still playing games with you. They're still trying to hide stuff from you. Let's see what came out in the cards. The letter R, first, a middle, last initial, V. My spirit guide, Miss Jane, is here. You could be listening to me from the state of Hawaii, Iowa. If you give me a shout out, I'll give you a holler back. Your name could be Olivia, Patricia, Samantha, Sandra, or Sarah. The letter D, first, middle, last initial. Your name could be Jack, Thomas, Harry, Joshua. 
Yes, we have the great state of Texas here. The letter G is here. The state of Nebraska is here. The state of Georgia is here. W and F, first and last initial. What are the messages for the collective spiritual gridlock standoff? They can't get out of this. They messed up. I'm hearing for life, for life. This karmic is going to stick to them for life. If they don't get some spiritual strength, some spiritual balls, I hate to say it. Somebody got angry in the past when I used that terminology, but it's true. How can you be in the spirit and spirit led and up the spirit and you're a coward? You can't face people. You can't heal yourself. You can't deal with your triggers and triggers and your traumas. You got to go back in the past and you got to feel the pain. It ain't going to feel good when you're healing. You got to deal with the scabs that are going to scab up. You're going to think you will and something's going to come along in life and rip that scab right back off and let you see that you have some more healing to do. Your person is in a spiritual gridlock standoff with the devil. You're being protected from this. You could be listening to me from Nevada. Another one of my spirit guides, Miss Jane, Miss Helen. Uh, the letter J, the letter H is very prevalent in the names on today. You could be listening to me from Kentucky. You could be under Pisces energy, Pisces sun sign. The letter X is here and the letter J. Let's get a little bit more uh, energy here. What are the messages for the collectives? They're in a spiritual gridlock, a standoff, and still trying to trick and run games. God is getting tired of this kind of foolishness. Oh my God. Just heal yourself so you can free yourself. Somebody type in the comment section, heal yourself so you can free yourself. Michelle, Teresa, Gwendolyn, Marty, you could be at Aries. You could be listening to me from Alaska. Your name could be Amy, Melinda, Kelly, Tanya, or Joy. Georgia is here twice. Tars Energy is here. At the bottom of the deck, we have Hannah, Julie, Jean, Jacqueline, Jackie. At the top of the deck, we have Jamie, Remote. Ramona, Rhonda, Rita, Ruthie. Wow, the names are here today. Let's play with our little spiritual wheel of fortune here, our little cards, our names and numbers and letters. Let's just see what else Spirit wants to show us. If I look over some letters, you guys already know the routine. Feel free to go in the comment section and point out maybe names, uh, places I didn't see. Okay, let's see. I know we don't have the letter A here, but I hear Jax, J-A-X. These could be uh, parts of your license plate number. Uh, grid is here. See, they, they're trying to keep something off grid from you. What they trying to hide from you? They need to be calling you for prayer, but they're trying to keep something off the grid. Wait a minute. Oh my God, y'all. The, the name of this read is Spiritual Grid Lock. Stand off. If your person's name start with a J, that's who I'm talking about. Bam, there it is. They're miserable. They don't even want to be with who they with. They're fighting. They're arguing. I hear the money has ran out. The money is running out. The money has ran out. Pick, pick, pick one. Pick one. Just pick one. Mm. J, F is here. F, J, V, J. Oh, my God. W, w R. I'm just calling out initials here. Look, y'all. They want to get rid of the person. Their karma is they can't. At least not right now. I would not want to be your person or the person that's on your mind. This energy is out of control. And I, I can't even make it up. I would look, they want to forward. They want to hit fast forward. They want to get out of this mess. Mm. They messed up. That's what they get for for playing. You know what? I'm just gonna keep this moving. Let's just put some numerology on this grid. So I know they're locked down now. We getting the work. We getting the the spelling is coming out in the letters, guys. Y'all see that? Y'all with me? Y'all rolling with me? Hanging there with me? I just love y'all for putting up with my different voice, my strange way of doing things to be re completely rejected. Y'all, look, I'm learning what it feels like to be completely celebrated one minute by an entire society. And the next minute, you're the villain. But I'm also learning what it feels like to be completely rejected by one group of people and totally loved by over 20, 23,000 plus. Wow, what a replacement. So 1444, when I looked at the timer, I'm so thankful for you guys. 
just know I'm healing. I'm going through things with you guys. I'm being triggered. I'm dealing with scab removal and everything else, just like you guys. Let's put some numerology on this read. What is going on? Spiritual dreadlock, standoff. Y'all looking at the thing. Y'all see what's coming out. Here come the number 10. 10 been raining in the reads on today that it's been raining it's been at, well in this week period 10 let's see what we got here we got the number 30 we got the number one we got the number 50 we have nine 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 zero 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 ten ten the synchronicities are out like crazy look at this synchronicity right here uh we gonna count down to from 10 nine to zero <laughs> Look, all of this is karma. You could be 50, you could be 30. This is so hurtful. Oh, your person, they're in pain. I'm so sorry. People need to listen. You want you told this person, don't do this. Stop playing with people 1555 when I looked up at the counter. They're hangman energy. They're stuck. Have you ever seen what a hangman look like? Sacrifice. They, I'm hearing they sacrifice themselves and don't even know it. We have a number, another number synchronicity of 1221 here. The world card. Fulfillment, completion, your situation, your time with this person is over. Let it go. It's ended. They got to get out this spiritual gridlock. They got to get off this, get out of this spiritual standoff with this de demonic activity. The emperor, he, he played himself. It could be an empress. Adjust the energies as needed. 55 changes here. You could be 55. The tower again. Look at this. Y'all know I go under the deck on top of the deck. There's the tower again. The number 16. You can have Capricorn Earth energy is here. Very strong. Taurus. Virgo. Libra energy is here as well. Taurus. Aries. Leo. Gemini. You could have a birthday of April the 16th, April the 21st, April the 30th, September the 1st, September the 4th, September the 30th. Wow. Let's, let's get a few more. I mean, it's, it's like I can, I can barely even expound. The energy is so thick. I don't know if any of you can feel this. Something's coming to a head. I'm hearing it's coming to a head. And why did I just literally see in my spirit excuse me, a, a pimple, acne, when it, when it, when it, um, you know how they say it becomes ripe where you can extract the content so you can avoid affection, pus, running. I just hear it. It's about the blow. Like I see some really ugly skin. This person could be dealing, something could be wrong with their skin, uh, itching, dryness, something. Uh, it could be some type of a viral infection, a disease, warts. Oh my God. I'm hearing warts. I am hearing pus. Wow, I'm singing this right now. Something's about to blow. Something's about to come to a head. We have the number six. That's lovers in uh, tarot. Look, 55555 five, 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 change. 333, three, three. you are protected spiritually. 888, eight, eight. we got karma here. Look at this karmic activity. 1414. Y'all come on here. Look at this. 5555. Five, five, five. All these changes are coming in T towers are falling stuff is being uncovered somebody is such a liar oh god they've told so many lies they've told so many lies the lies i just hear the lies the lies we tell the lies they've told is about to be you know what they done made spirit sick and i'm hearing that when this person gets done dragging them through the karmic hell that they signed up for everything you need to know ever wondered about it's going to be made spiritual spiritually public to you collective nothing's gonna be hid from you and you're gonna have tangible 3d receipts on most of this foolishness that i'm picking up on let's get some some messages here i don't even know whether to say these are messages coming from the karmic the person on your mind i don't care if they married they got tied up with a karmic I don't care if these adjust the energies is needed because I'm hearing some stuff about to come out in these cards. What are the messages for the collect? Pretending. I this person been pretending. Not with you. You figured it out. The karmic does not know who they're dealing with because your person is wearing the 
the biggest mask. Why do I see the actual mask? The movie, Jim Carrey. You remember how that mask would stick on his face? That's the kind of mask they wear. Mm. Love triangle. I can't make this stuff. It's over. Wow. Pretending love, it's over. See, that's what they want to say to the karmic. You've already, you know that it's over between you and the person. They regret this foolishness that they got tied up in. They regret it. They know it's over with you. They know you're literally disgusted by what they're doing to people. Wow. Let's let's get some more messages here. I, somebody needs to hear this read. Somebody is crying tears right now. And they are not tears of joy. You, This person hurt you. They hurt you. And I get it. They were very toxic. Sweetie, dear sir. Handsome person. Beautiful. Let this go. That was toxic. You have arrived. You're leveling up. You're growing. You're healing. Look, they're the ones missing out. They were stronger with you. Because they sure ain't doing nothing without you. They ain't going nowhere without you. They got karmic debt to pay for hurting you. Please believe me. Deep emotions will then reverse. Whoever they're with now is shallow. It's so hurtful to you, though, to see. Stay off of social media. Don't even look. If this person, just stay away from social media. Look, because it ain't worth it. It's not worth it. It was also in reverse. That's that person saying what they did wasn't worth it. They're with the wrong person. I can't make this stuff up. Pull away is in reverse. They can't. They want to get away from this demon. What did they do to bind themselves to this person? Cut off. They want out of this. They cut you off and got tied up with something they can't pull away from. Spirit, if you would be so gracious, if you would be so kind, would you please let us in on what did they do? Because you can get, you don't, you're not stuck to nobody. You don't have to put up with it. What did they do? How did they bind themselves? And what has happened? I see dollar signs. There's some money. What did they do? I got to be strong. No longer pretending, no longer able to pretend. Collective, be strong for whatever's getting ready to blow. They want to heal this connection with you guys. 22, 22 on the timer when I looked up. This is crazy. I'm just trying to see if we can find out what, why do they feel like they can't let go of this karma? Well, we know it's karma, but they literally feel they're scared or they can't walk. Divinely guided is in reverse. They went against spirit to get with this person. So what is it? I get that. Maybe that bound them to the person just simply being hard headed. What did they do to bind themselves to this? I hear ignorant energy. Oh my God. True feelings, judge free. They don't want you to judge them. Because I guess if you really knew why they went after this, this is some old uh, super narcissist crap right here. They did something on, they they took it to the, they pushed it to the limit, to the max. I'm hearing steroids. And everybody know that ain't healthy. Taking steroids. Mm, mm, flexing. Fake flex. Fake flex. Somebody type in, type in the comment section. They were fake flexing. It wasn't even real. Look, tell you telling the truth. You're probably the only person ever told this person the truth. Karmic situation. In and out is upside down, meaning they can't move right now. Happiness is in reverse here. Come on. This is crazy. Fix things is in reverse. They can't as long as they're tied up with this energy. Intimacy was in reverse, meaning the sex is bad or they ain't getting any. Illegal. I said, what did they do? to tie themselves to this karmic. And look at what we got, illegal. Coming clean, something's illegal. They did something illegal, too much damage. You know what, <laughs> I'm being led to end this read right here. Very toxic, dis disturbing energy. I gotta cleanse my energy now, picking up on this mess right here. I mean, this is mess. Yeah, y'all hear me fussing. I ain't gonna cuss, but this is a bunch of mess right here. This is bull crap.
at its finest. I'm disgusted. You know what I'm, I'm hearing? Those aren't even my feelings. I'm channeling from spirit. I'm channeling from the karmic anger person. Everybody involved is disgusted. And they're at a spiritual standoff, a gridlock. Who's going to make a move? Who's going to be bold? Who's going to really say, I'm done pretending. I'm tired of this. I'm out. out. Did you want to know what your person got into this read right here? A hot karmic mess. I hope that I said something that resonates with someone. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. It would be greatly appreciated. Until next time. Bye-bye.